Well, hello friends, Mark Holmes here, and as always, I want to thank you all for watching Joe Boo's Day Job, of course, as you can see, Joe Boo's Day Job. Now, we're working on a, a unit that we have to go ahead and get squared away and stuff, the tenants moved out. We had a little bit of damage on the floor because they had dogs that they weren't supposed to have, and I need to be better about that. So, to cover ourselves in the future, they have actually now, the carpet padding has actually um, a seal Okay, these don't really, oh yeah, this one does, uh, have a seal that's actually on the padding. Now here's the thing, you can go to Home Depot and Lowe's, and, and, and let me be clear, um, I have a Home Depot and a Lowe's credit card, and I do shop at both of them, both of them quite a bit, but you can't get everything to it. What you have to think of is Home Depot and Lowe's are like 7-Eleven. They carry a little bit of everything, but sometimes you need to go to the specialties. Now let me give you a little example with carpet. It is better to have really good padding and cheap carpet versus cheap padding and really good carpet because good carpet padding will make a cheap carpet feel really good. And if you have great carpet and terrible pad, it's going to feel terrible. So it's key to get really good padding. So I ended up buying my padding from, of course, my... Um, uh, carpet wholesaler um, distributor and things which is going to save you some money and to give you an example what we got with them is it's half inch thick which is very thick eight pound and that's the density on it and it cost us well I'll show it to you when we get back over um, basically this is the same stuff right here this is an eight pound eight pound right here 30 yard roll 84 cents 84 cents a square foot so it's $227 for that padding. I know you're thinking, wow, that's like the carpet. Yeah, that literally is. Now you can go with thinner density, I mean, uh, thinner carpet. This is actually 7 16 which is quite a bit thinner, down to $99 a roll. Or you can go down here to 5 16 which is really, really thin. Still eight pound density, and that's like $67. Now you could go ahead and do that, but I'm telling you, you're better off getting the really good padding. And I'm gonna show you the difference with it. Oh, by the way, so here it is. 227 for that roll. I bought the same thing, the same thing. $90 a roll at the carpet wholesaler. That's a big, big savings. So basically, I bought two of these for less than one of those. Okay, so before I actually head back home, I wanna actually show you guys something here. What we have, this is our carpet padding. And you see how it's got that blue seal on it? That is actually um, seals it and waterproofs it. Costs a little bit more to do that, although going to my carpet wholesaler does save money by me going there as opposed to if I bought this at Home Depot. <laughs> Remember, 277, I'm sorry, $227 a roll for this at my carpet wholesaler. Exactly the same product. It ends up costing uh, about 95. So major saving there. And here's the thing about it. Had I purchased that kind of padding, have this issue here, which is unfortunately pet stains because I ended up having tenants that ended up keeping uh, the dogs in the hallway. And you can see where it penetrated the carpet, the carpet padding, and into the floor. And we're gonna have to go through and we're gonna have to go through, scrape the floor up. We end up using urinate on here to help eat up. It's like an enzyme to eat up the uh, urine and break it up. But then we're gonna need to paint it with uh, kills to make sure that it seals it up because we do not want that odor to seep through. We, we definitely want whoever moves in here to have a really nice home that is odor free. And uh, yeah, this is one of those things that live and learn. So spend a little bit extra money on getting the padding because again, it's better to spend more money on the padding than it is on the carpet. Carpet, you could spend $20 a yard on a carpet and if you put crap padding underneath of it, it's going to feel like crap carpet. You can buy $7 a yard carpet and you put that padding underneath of it, it's going to feel like a great, great carpet. So again, some places you want to try and save some money. Other places you want to look at it and say, hmm, 
I need to get some good products that's going to last and help keep me from having problems. I've had this project, project excuse me, property since 2008 maybe, and this is only the second time I've had to go through and paint it. Use good paint, use good materials, and you'll end up having fewer problems. And that's our tip right now for how to save yourself some time and some money. I'm Mark Holmes, and we're going to keep you straight. See you soon.